Vile. Be vivacious. Be victorious. Vipe victories. Always be in your element. Good evening. Soviet troops mass on the borders of Afghanistan. Talks break down between the Nixon administration and the Kremlin. And in Washington, the doomsday clock now sits at six minutes to midnight. Tonight on World in Focus, we ask the question, are we on the brink of nuclear war? I'm joined in the studio by French Pulitzer Prize winning photojournalist Alain Guillon, whose iconic photographs hanging in the studio behind us are considered by many to be among the defining images of the Vietnam War. And from the US, Professor Hal Eisner, author of the controversial new book, In the Shadow of Manhattan. Good evening, Jeremy. Hello. From the meltdowns, with the fruity fallout taste that will blow you all the way to China. I'd include masked heroes in that group that's a benefit to society, too. John is a, I'm sorry, a Dr. Manhattan is, uh, is something else entirely. Opportunity that confirmed that, as suspected, he was actively involved in the conflict. Yeah, well, I suppose I was lucky to get this shot, uh, but I don't consider that I was lucky to meet this man. He's a, he's a monster. I mean, he, he, he's supposed to be American secret weapon in Vietnam, and he just thought it was a, he just thought it was a joke. I have no masks, toll free to report. Sources say Vite Energy is nearing a breakthrough. Having collaborated with Dr. Manhattan on the development of free energy, Vite is expected to make a major announcement that will change the world. The century, in fact, Dr. Manhattan's appearance on day one of Operation Wrath of God. Yeah, <clears throat> you, you can't imagine how it is, uh, because it's very difficult for the mind to accept, to, 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 to take pictures of such terrible, insane events. One moment, there is soldiers there, the next, they're gone. And it seems that all this was nothing to him, less than nothing. He, he just took them apart without uh, hesitation, you know? Indeed, indeed. Well, this is in fact something you cover in great depth in your book, don't you, Professor Eisner? Absolutely. It's difficult to believe that such an incredible being could even exist. On one hand, he... Feeling big? A fear. There's a terrible fear. You know, I think I can, uh, can boil the... The feeling out of three words, really, it's, uh, we've been replaced. And I don't just mean the masked adventurers, I mean humanity. We've been replaced. Accident at Gila Flats had never happened. If Manhattan had never even actually come into being, would America still have won the war? Without Manhattan, it easily could have gone on for another 10 years. Could Nixon have then changed the Constitution to secure a third term? we wouldn't be in the position we're in today were it not for the existence of Dr. Manhattan. Without him, we'd be living in a completely different world. Some might say a better one. Well, sadly, we have to move on. <laughs>